Jangan dengar sepuk ya What's going on guys, Boat here, welcome to episode 10 of Boaty vs Bosses and today we are killing the Tuztok Jad and I've just got to wave 62 and I've killed one of the level 360s so next wave after I've killed that one is obviously the Jad and obviously I've killed like 800 Jads in my time so it would be boring if I just killed one if I'd be like, no oh, I've seen that so many times so I have 8 way switches with press which is that I'll be trying to pull off along with trying to keep my health up and only one brew in case of mistake so if I die I will go for a round two and if I die again round three obviously until I kill it if I don't die however it will only be the one kill so I'm gonna guess that you're not gonna wish me luck on this one so you can see multiple more but we will see what happens guys so wish me luck okay so while I uh, kill this thing what I want to quickly say is uh, throughout doing this cave there is a small little kind of like a glitch kind of thing that I came upon where I was training defense experience due to changing attack styles on the weapon so I will be using my Kaedic crossbow on the accurate mode and not the rapid because if I actually switch to the rapid mode it goes to long range and I don't want to risk any more defense XP so that is um there won't be any style switches but you'll have the eight ways and the press switches plus I have to press switch with the Jad so hopefully this will be exciting but first of all right there it is so of course you all want like a Jad guide on blocking healers I will not have a guide for blocking healers today because I will be running around, I don't want to stand still, that'll be boring. So first I need to lure it over here though, that'll be quite useful, so that should get it over here. There we go, that'll do. So, it looks like I'm going to be taking on the healers as well, good luck to my life, good luck with you Jad. So it's uh, straight away, this is a nice looking, well, mage attack, so... I don't. I, I want to like click rapid, but at the same time I don't, because I don't want to risk getting defense XP, because if I'm uh, getting defense XP, like throughout recording this I may not like properly notice it which would really suck like seriously I wouldn't even notice I was training it so can we just not go there really okay horrible switch can't even see what I'm doing anymore oh did I did get everything no I didn't don't be me this thing refuses to switch its attack styles that's really boring I, I didn't even attack it what's going on oh I'm on accurate mode no wonder I think I'm on rapid I apologize guys right okay right he's moved underneath me healer time you know what that sucks we're doing rapid come on this is this is so bad I took, no, I don't need to attack that one. Get that one. And then Mage Prey. Let's get... I can't even right-click the thing. Let's get that one. And then let's do that to Augury. Get this one. Now let's kill all these with Mage because I'm a beast like that. So, come on! Killing all these. This is uh, rather boring. Did I even attack that one? The hell? Alright, let's go. Wow. This is really not going well because everything's just... I'm sure I'm clicking everything correctly, but it's just not happening. I don't know why. Let me quickly kill these, and we'll get back into the uh, tri breeding of. I have attacked that one about 15 times, and it just refuses to walk over here. Why? What's the Jad's health? I don't mind if it was full, because I can just kill it again then. So there goes my overload. So if I quickly get this uh, back up, there's a switch. But I want to get into the tri breeding, but I can't because everything's going wrong. Well, there goes my brew. So that might. Uh, if I get to low health, it might make the video better. If I miss a prayer, I'm not fussed if I die, to be fair, because I can just go back. Do it again, and you can have a, a longer episode, really. So, come on, can I please kill all these things? Because this is really boring. I want to get back to killing Jad. Stop healing! God, I hated doing this cave. I don't like doing them with the Augury and Rigorum because it's so much quicker to do it with curses. Because, obviously, the Zex hit back on the curses. Let's get my health to full. So, therefore, if I miss a prayer, I'll spend the rest of the fight on low HP. So, I will try a change attack styles around just to like make it better, so here we go, let's get some switches going, make sure it's on accurate, yep, that's correct, let's run over here, let's get that on, uh, let's do that, click that, click that, double check the defense XP, we are fine, All right, I need to run around, but suddenly I'm lagging, which just kind of sucks, so, yeah, so let's uh, do that, do that, good switch, good switch, and go again, oh no, that's a failed switch, that's alright, we want low HP, low HP makes the video more exciting, so, oh wow, these switches are really bad, they are really bad, so I can't even see it. Can it move around more? That would be more fun. A Jad that moved around, that would be exciting. All right, let's go. Get it on accurate. And let's uh, hit it once. What's his health? Oh, it's almost dead. That sucks. This video was so bad. Right, okay, let's go. I have done, like, not a single good switch. Nope, see what I mean? Long range. Now I've trained defense XP. But he's died on the defense XP trains. But as you can see, the switching So That video was just horrible, but... I gave it a try and everything just went wrong and there's a free fire cape so maybe the next episode will be more exciting where I take on two jads at once. So thanks for watching guys and peace!